What's going on, you two? This is Sam Knight. Some of you actually might know me from some past videos on Spanko's channel. Uh, I just decided that I would uh, give Spanko some content, so I'm gonna open this box of Blazing Vortex for you guys. So, uh, as far as what I'd like to see out of it, I mean, obviously there's the pot card that everyone's looking for. Starlight rares are always nice to collect. Uh, the Underworld Goddess Secret is a very interesting card, so I'd like to pull out one of those. And for those of you who have seen me on the channel before, it should come to no as a surprise to you that I would like to collect the S-Force cards, because at this point I'm pretty much contractually obligated to pull any card that has the word column in its name. <laughs> Alrighty, so let's start this off. So far, I've opened one box of this so far, and I've gotten a few S-Force foils. I haven't pulled any S-Force supers, and I haven't pulled any pots yet. So here's to hoping. All right, so we'll start with this one. And we'll set this to the side. All righty, without further ado, let's get started. So for our first pack of the day, we have Giga Thunder Giclops, Steel Star Regulator, Spriggan's Branga, Profe S Force Professor De Gamma. I think I pulled three of these already, but always nice to see him. Dragoonie Tonight Gormfalbar is our super for the our first super. Dream Mirror Recap, Tri Brigade Rendezvous, Synchro Transmission, and Radiant Vurescence. Interesting. This card is all, like, any dragon that is light or dark attribute is always worth keeping an eye on, just in case. Uh, as far as what this one does, when this card is normal summoned while your opponent controls a monster, you discard a card, send any number of Radiant Vurescence from your deck to the graveyard. Okay, so this thing can fill your deck, your graveyard up with light dragons. So, and also, if this card's in your graveyard, you can make this card in the graveyard become dark. Okay, yeah, this card is actually, you should definitely keep an eye on this. They're also, like, not, they're, as far as commons go, they are quite common to pull, because I think I've pulled multiple, I've pulled way more than three in my last box. So, I would definitely hold on to those if you're, ever thinking about playing Chaos or Dragons or anything like that. Okay, next pack. Neroy, uh, the Dream Mirror Disciple, Warrock Skylar, eh, Warrocks, but, well, I guess we're the ones laughing because they end up in these packs. Another Degamma, Fabled Marcosia, Armed Dragon Thunderbolt for our super, Machina Unclasper, Spriggan's Pedor, and Archfiend's Staff of, Des Staff of Despair. Shout out to the skull that we never got for the actual Axe of Despair. And Warrock Orpus. Oh man, two Warrock cards in the same pack. Neg. Alrighty, we have Neroi, Reinforcement of the Army's Troops, Linary or Equation Cannon. Uh, this card's name makes me think of Math Max and it makes me sad. I wish that deck was better. Arm Dragon Lightning, Arm Dragon Thunder Level 3 for our Super, Spriggan's Blast, Digital, Digital Bug Registrider, and Sprint the Iron Dash Dragon, oh, and Wind Witch Blizzard Bell. I wouldn't mind getting uh, the Wind Witch cards as well. I pulled a bunch of Blizzard Bell in my last box, but I didn't pull any of the Ultras, and I only pulled one Chime, so getting those wouldn't be bad either. Fabled Marcosia, Call... Giclops, Regulator, Great Sea Sand Gold Golgonda. That's not bad. I don't mind. I've been sort of like off, like not extreme, not, not extremely, but I'm like slowly collecting the Spriggans as well, just because. Tilted Try, Dream Mirror Recap, Tri Brigade Rendezvous, Synchro Transmission. Alrighty. Still no secrets or ultras. Hopefully that means they're good when I finally pull them, and they're there, and they're actually there. Spriggan's Rocky, Dual Avatar Ascendants, Heavy Metal Foes Amalgam, 
Pendulum Encore. And oh my god, are you serious? Ugh. This is the second Arm Dragon Thunder level 10 that I've pulled. And I, all right. Anyway, War Rock Ordeal is our next card. Oh my god, how do I pull two of them out of the two boxes? Race, Raging Storm Dragon, Buford 9. Machina Unclass Bear, Amano Kujaki. Here's our last card there. Ugh. Alrighty. All right, shake off bad vibes. If we have bad vibes, we're gonna pull bad anyway for the rest of it. This could just mean that the rest of the cards that we pull are actually good. All right, Spriggan's Baranga, S-Force to Gamma, Fairy Archer in Ingunar, Arm Dragon Lightning, Wind Witch Diamond Bell. All right, I'll take it. Radiant Verescence, Breath of Acclamation. Top 10 cards getting reprints soon because they forgot to put Ritual, the Ritual icon on it. Uh, Virtual World Gate, Zuan Wu, and Stairway to a Fabled Realm. Alrighty, alrighty. It's okay. All right, Knight of Armor Dragon, Ancient Warrior Saga, Fabled Marcosia, Spriggan's Call, Angel Statue Azurune, or Azurune. That's actually not a bad card. If you're playing Eldlich, then you can do funny things with trap monsters in that card. Uh, S4 Specimen, Arm Dragon Blitz, Spriggan's Pedor, Tilted Try. Alrighty. Next pack, we have Parametal Foes Fusion, Guitar Gurnard's Duonigus. Alright. Again, like, this is... Why is that the card's name? Who is ever going to pronounce that correctly? Spriggan Branga. Icy Breeze Refrain. Ancient Warriors Rebellious Lu Feng. Ooh! Second version of cards that might get reprinted real soon, because supposedly this card has different effect text than, in, than its OCG counterpart, and it makes it worse over here. Sort of like... Art, uh, Altergeist Hextia and Altergeist um, Manifestation was when they were first printed. So we might see this card get reprinted sooner than later. Oh, that was a super. I'll put that down. Uh, the Fabled Abenak, Fabled Treason, Archfiend Staff, and Spriggan's Blast. Alrighty, next pack. Neroy the Dream Mirror Disciple, Linear Equation, War Rock Skylar, Giga Thunder Gitclops, Materiactor Gigarda. Hold on to the Materiactors Actors if you ever end up with them, because we might get more of them, and if they keep being as like as interesting as these cards or better, then they are definitely worth worth looking out for. Stairway to a Fable of the Realm, Tri Brigade Rendezvous, Archfiend Staff of Despair, and Radiant Varescence. See, I pulled like three Varescence already, and I'm not even halfway done the box. Pick them up while they're super cheap and no one uses them. Linear Equation Cannon, Arm Dragon Lightning, Spriggan's Rocky, Dual Avatar Ascendance, Wind Witch Freeze Bell for our first Ultra Rare. I'll take that. Is that our first Ultra Rare? No, it's not. Diamond Bell was another Ultra Rare. Forgot about that. Ugh. Alrighty. Blizzard Bell, Ordeal, Beaufort 9, and Unclass Bear. Alrighty. Armor Dragon Ritual, Dogmatica Genesis, Parametaphors Fusion, S Force Showdown, Fabled Andrafe. Spriggan's Captain Sargus, Arm Dragon Blitz, War Rock Orcus, and Tilted Try. Ooh, this pack somewhat feels heavier for some reason. Don't know why. Heavy Metal was Amalgam, Pendulum Encore, Knight of Armor Dragon, Ancient Warrior Saga, Wind Witch Chimes, not bad. Amano Kujaki, S4 Specimen, Arm Dragon Blitz, Spriggan's Pedor. Not sure why that one felt heavier than the others, but whatever. 
Ancient Warriors Saga, Knight of Armor, Amalgam, Parametalfo's Melcaster, War Rock Fortia. Is this the good one, or is it? If your Earth Warrior and Monster battles after Danny's calculation, add a Warrior card, War Rock card from your deck to your hand, and all. No, it's not. Ugh. Well, none of them are great, but there's at least one War Rock that's playable in other decks. Uh, Unclass Bear, Spriggan's Blast, Fabled Treason, and a Mono Kajaki. This thing, uh, Igonar, Genesis, Giclops, White Baking, Skull Servant memes, excellent. Synchro Transmission, Force Specimen, Dream Mirror Recap, The Fabled Abenak. Dual Avatar Ascendance, Neroi the Dream Mirror Disciple, Linear Equation Cannon, War Rock Skylar. Whoa! Card upside down, but S Force Orifice. That's my first Orifice, actually. I'll take it. Stairway to a Fabled Realm. Tri Brigade Rendezvous, Staff of Despair, and another Varescence. Uh, Degamma, Marcosia, Melcaster, Encore, Onero, Oneros, the Dream Mirror Tormentor, Spriggan's Pedor, Staff of Despair, Orpus, and Ordeal. Still looking for one more secret and two more ultras. Hopefully we can make up for this. Icy Breeze Reframe, Marcosia, Duoningus, Inungar, Spriggan's Watch. That's a quality super. Yee! Ojama Pink. Alrighty. Synchro Transmission, S4 Specimen, and Dream Mirror Recap. Alrighty, we're down to the last few. How many we got left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven left. Alrighty. We're on the home stretch now. Alrighty, next one. We've got Reinforcement of the Army's Troops, Spriggan's Rocky, Steel Star Regulator, Spriggan's Baranga, Tri Brigade Kit, not bad, Digital Bug Registrider, Tribe of Rendezvous, Spring the Iron Dash, Breath of Acclamation. Alrighty. Baranga, Refrain, Neroi, Skylar, Materiactor Gigaboros, Fabled Treason, Archfiend Staff, Blast, and Unclass Bear. I feel like I've pulled these three cards in order in the last three in the pack a couple times now. Alrighty, Melcaster, Encore, Showdown, Call. Alrighty, Ultra number three, Arm Dragon Thunder level seven. I keep pulling Arm Dragon Thunder cards. War Rock Ordeal, Blizzard Bell, Sargus, and Pink. All right, just a couple left. Uh, Igonar, Lightning, Metal Foes Fusion, this thing. Arm Dragon Thunder level five. Excellent. Did I pull a level three? Did we get every single Arm Dragon Thunder card? Yeah, we did. We did it, boys. We collected all four of them. <laughs> God. Breath of Acclamation. Virtual World Gate, Zuan Wu, Stairway to a Fabled Realm, The Fabled Almanac, Albac, Abenac, bleh. Is there a Fabled Almanac? Um, is that why I'm thinking of it? Steel Star Regulator, Spriggan's Baranga, Icy Breeze Refrain, Fabled Marcosia, Maha Vilo, Light of Darkness. Nice callback. Not sure how viable it is, though. Rendezvous, Sprind, Breath, and Pink. All right. Two left, which means they should be ultra and secret, unless I'm super negging on this box, or I'm silly and I've accidentally 
not notice that I pulled an ultra. Nope. All right. Let's see what this one is gonna be then. We've got Dogmatic Genesis, Giga Thunder Giclops, Reinforcing the Army's Troops, Armored Dragon Ritual, S Force Justify for our third, fourth Ultra. Not bad. I already have one. I'm not sure how many the deck would actually a deck actually plays, but that's okay. Fabled Abenak, Virtual World Gate, and Buford Nine and Pedor. All right, last pack. And here's the secret, hopefully. All right. Let's just rub these pack, rub it for good luck. All right, here we go. Now, if I'm thinking correctly, it's one, two, three, four, and then this is the foil, so we'll put it in the back. And we'll put these back in the front. Hopefully I counted that right. Uh, so we have S-Force Showdown, Spriggan's Call, Reinforcement of the Army's Troops, Spriggan's Rocky, Wind Witch Blizzard Bell, Spriggan's Captain Sargus, Ojama Pink, Digital Bug Registrider. And our last card is... Oh my god, it's a spell card. Um, okay. What spell cards come in secret rare? There's the pot. There's the S-Force Field spell. There's Arm Dragon Flash, which would suck. And there's the Warrock Field spell, which I don't really care for. All right. <sighs> Let's see. Last card is... Oh, yes! Yes! <laughs> we got the pot, boys! Woo! There we go! All righty. I am happy today. All right. I don't even care. This card... Fuck this card, but still. <laughs> All right. I am okay with that. We pulled the full meme set of 10, 7, 5, and 3. We pulled a Justify, and we also pulled an Orphist. We pulled two Wind Witch Ultras, which is not bad. Get rid of this thing. Anything else that was interesting to pull? We pulled... As a root, as a rune, which isn't bad. We pulled some other good stuff, but that doesn't matter because we pulled the pot, boys. We pulled the $150 Canadian card on release out of an $80 box. We basically got it half off, and I got a whole bunch of stuff else. So, where's my sleeves? I'm gonna sleeve this up right away. Alrighty, well, that worked out nicely. So. Uh, thanks for watching, I guess. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe to Spanko. And who knows, you might see me again someday in the future with another box opening or deck profile or whatever. We'll see what happens. All right, anyway, signing out now. Peace.